Hi, my name is Dr. Christian Yeast from Ballantine Center for Dentistry. And as a community member, a father, a dentist, I'd like to address an issue that all of us are facing right now, the coronavirus, COVID-19. It's out there and everybody's talking about it on a daily basis. All the news outlets, all the papers are addressing it and everybody's actually kind of freaking out. The uh, media and others are telling people, you need to stay away, you need to go nowhere, schools are dangerous, this is a danger, that is a danger. So what I'd like to discuss with you are the places that are not safe to go and the places that are safe to go to. So let's talk about supermarkets, schools, department stores, concerts, restaurants. Definitely, those are places where people congregate, where there are no protocols for any kind of sterilization or protection. Those are some of the places you and others can transmit certain types of bacteria and viral infections a lot easier than if you than you can in places that have protocols in place pretty much all the time, start to finish, eight hours a day, where sterilization is being done religiously. In a dental office, we must sterilize all the instruments and disinfect every surface in the room after every single patient. So I want you to kind of bring, I wanted to kind of bring that to people's attention. A common question we've been getting recently is, can I go to the dentist and continue doing my treatment or should I procrastinate and do this after everything kind of settles down and blows over? Well, right now, to be honest with you, is not the time to procrastinate. Right now is the right time to actually go to the dental office and get your treatment done. Right now, you want to make sure you're as healthy as possible. It's more important than ever that you're in great health and your immune system is strong. A vital part of having a healthy immune system is having a healthy mouth. So another thing to consider is that if everyone waits to get treatment done, then you are potentially putting yourself in a position where it may take longer to get an appointment in the future due to the backups that may occur. I, I want to show you an example of what happens in a dental laboratory between every patient. So let me go to a treatment room and show you what our system does on a daily basis, and you can see for yourself. Okay, everybody, so now we are in a dental laboratory. Meet Stephanie. She is our dental assistant. So Stephanie, what are you currently doing? Yes, so what I'm showing you is our cavi wipes. This is what we use to disinfect the chair as well as the entire room. They kill all viruses, bacteria, and fungi upon contact. In fact, the solution in these cavi wipes is so strong that we have to wear gloves when using them. What do these barriers here do? So these protect the patients from various high-touch surfaces in the operatory. These are disposed of sanitarily between every patient. So you replace these after every patient? Yes, absolutely. Um, it's mandated by law, and it's something that we've been doing every day for years. Right, so this is standard protocol, guys. Coronavirus or no coronavirus, dentists have all been doing this for a very long time. And this is just the tip of the iceberg on what we do to sanitize our office. So let me show you our sterilization center as well. Okay, everyone, this is actually our state-of-the-art sterilization center. And as you can see, there are three autoclaves and other devices in this room designed to keep our patients safe. It goes without saying that we take your protection very seriously. In addition to everything that we've shown you so far, we're also taking additional measures to ensure the safety of our patients while they wait in our lobby. We've put up signs on our door, turning people away who have recently traveled to other countries or show any signs or symptoms of fever or sore throat. This is our sign right here. So remember guys, right now it's more important than ever to ensure you have a healthy, robust immune system. In order to do that, you must have a healthy mouth. Now is not the time to delay dental treatment or put off your oral health. I hope this uh, video gave you some comfort in coming to the dental office, and we look forward to seeing you soon. Have a great day. This has been Dr. Christian Yeast from the Ballantine Center for Dentistry.